So for today, we're going to be looking at the Titans raid armor set. Again, I've already done the Warlock raid armor set for the Vow of the Disciple. If you guys haven't seen that video, I'll have it in the description below. But this is the Titans. So let Titans, let me know what you guys think. Did you guys, do you guys think you guys won? Let me know in the comments below. But let's get right into it. So as you guys can see, this is the Titans. I think the Titans may have won this just because of the sheer amount of pieces that I'm like, I would wear this. I would wear this. So first off, let's go with the helmet. The helmet is definitely a piece that I'm going to be trying to wear a lot because of the face. The face looks absolutely intimidating. I love it. Uh, I also think the back piece, uh, the circle thing, I think that looks really cool as well. The only issue is what the hell am I going to combine this with? I don't like this is my issue with making armor pieces look really, really unique is the fact that it's going to be it makes it even more challenging to make an armor set around that piece because uh this whole armor set is just oozing i have never seen this armor set in the game ever and now you're asking me to combine a set with this i just don't know how i'm going to do it it's going to be rough it's definitely going to be rough for the practice armor set at the end but uh i will tell you guys i might not use the helmet uh the piece that i actually might end up using is the boots i love the boots the boots are so good <clears throat> not only are they symmetrical but you can use them in almost a lot of things you can use them in like your knight builds you can use them in just an armor set build like an art like a big juggernaut build you can do that with that because it looks really good with it uh i think the weakest part from this whole set maybe the arms actually i think the arms are just kind of like very generic not generic but just boring in my opinion compared to everything else it just it lacks let's just say that it lacks uh the chest piece is also something i'm not really a big fan of as you guys know i like uh titan chest pieces to like for the back specifically to have covering their their back and their neck i really like that because it just it looks better specifically i'll give you guys an example this chest piece right here is one of my favorite chest pieces in the game for the titans because it covers like the back of the neck and your back it, it just looks like a like something a titan would wear so when i see something like this where it's just it's just very thin it, it kind of makes me sad because for me titans should be should have bulky armor uh where this armor kind of like redeems itself is the fact that the rib cage uh armor pieces actually move which i think is super dope so that actually does save it for me and i'm like all right well i'll use it in something i just don't know what and last but not least i think the cloak or the mark is actually pretty cool uh you can definitely use it in other pieces it's not so unique where it's just like oh my god i don't know what to use it with because uh you can definitely use it with other pieces as for how it takes shaders, again, like the Warlock video, the Echoed Anger is displayed on the armor basic, just that's how the shader looks. So we'll be using another red shader, which is Carminica, definitely one of my favorite shaders. And I can already tell you this whole armor set looks really good with it, aside from the arms. As you guys can see, the arms have this like really weird brown tint to it, which is unfortunate. But other than that, everything is taking the shader very well even the mark surprisingly is taking it very well so i don't see any off color so that's really good let's actually check the next shader which is sato tribe and this one is looking it's still looking good man it's still looking good i will say that the arms still have that weird discoloration but that just might be a thing with the arms because the warlocks have that problem as well but it's looking good man uh the shader is really good i will say that the helmet the cheek side clothing does look like it takes the the, the secondary color which is weird um last but not least we're gonna be looking at dreaming spectrum which again ooh, this looks even better with it oh my god yeah this this armor just looks so good with specific shaders and this is definitely one of those shaders um titans let me know what you guys think i definitely think the arms are the weakest part if i'm being quite honest it definitely fits the theme because the chest piece is really thin and you don't want really bulky armors because then or really bulk, bulky arms because that would be very jarring but just make the chest bigger and then make the arms bigger is like the easiest fix for that so next up is going to be the example armor and this is the example armor i wanted to go something uh 
to with the boots obviously the boots is one of my favorites so i really wanted to lean into the boots however making this example armor really showed me that the boots are finicky unfortunately so if you guys haven't seen my review of the uh seasonal armor set that we got from the season pass the psionic strangler set uh if you guys haven't seen that video i'll link it in the description but essentially uh this aren't this these boots are a bitch to shader because like these look really good right now but if you take any any shader really and i'll give you the one that i know the most so for sure we're gonna go to Raguzian knight Raguzian has a purple it's it's a purple uh i'll show you guys over here purple as you guys can see there is the deep purple that has these symbols like just floating and then the off color is this like a uh, kind of like mm, light pink not wow uh like a uh, like a lavender i guess uh not the case with this one this one is just all like the like not even the off color this is like as you guys can see you can't even see this on the shader thing so i would say this is like a third color or an off color not even off color um what yeah it is the off color uh this is this is the main color this is the secondary color and the off color would be this one right here this uh this texture as well and then obviously you guys can see that it takes the off color or not the off color the secondary color so why am i bringing this up the reason i'm bringing this up is because you guys can't even see blue on this bro like what the fuck the reason i'm bringing this this up is because this these take the secondary color so the red would be the main color and then the black would be the secondary color the reason i'm saying this is because uh as you guys can see it's taking the off color of the shader not the main color which is not a problem as you guys can see it just looks off it looks really fucking weird so if you do want to combine like this doesn't look terrible actually this does not look bad only because the off color right here or the secondary color right here is also in the secondary color here and their secondary color here as well so that i can actually pull this shader off if i want but when i have stuff like this this is where it gets a little bit harder um just be aware that with this one it takes the secondary color not the the actual color the main color which is why i'm using the dreaming spectrum because uh it doesn't matter what plate armor you're wearing it will take the main color most of the time uh, as you guys can see the chest piece uh the you can see the difference in the color but from afar you can barely tell you have to actually squint in there to actually tell so that's why i'm using this shader but that's kind of like one of my main gripes just be aware that the the dreaming spectrum will be your best case for this but other than that i think this this uh, armor combination looks really cool the reason i'm using the 14th amnesius amnesius is uh just to make it look a little bit more grit grittier uh same thing with the with the mark i want it i want it, i want this chest piece, or i want this armor set to look gritty because the boots look really gritty like they look really crazy so i wanted to really try to make that look here so titans let me know what you guys think in the comments below i actually like the armor set the tit titans got i think i like it a little bit more than the warlocks actually just because there's so many pieces that are usable i didn't even mention the the new ornament that the side and ramparts got because that one also can go with it it's called trace of the throne you could definitely use it uh and i'll probably have a, uh, an example set right now just to show you guys but if you guys want to combine that armor set with this ornament, it's definitely going to look cool. So let me know what you guys think. Uh, be safe and I'll see you guys later. Why are you here?